guys how you doing my name is crystal and welcome to my youtube channel if you like my videos please smash that like button please do subscribe really 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 childish individuals that needs medical help not all there in the head i mean it's it's not the police can't deal with the many these the police can't deal with these individuals anyway they need a psychiatrist they need to be locked up in a secure mental hospital. Really, the trouble I've had today. Alexa, what's the time, please? It's 12.45pm. So it's 12.45pm. We knew the police weren't going to do anything. We knew the police are useless. We absolutely knew that. But um, I was um, getting dressed, ready to take Max out for a walk. Because I was told the police were coming this afternoon around 12 o'clock. I had two calls on unknown numbers. Right? Now all this abuse seems to be stemming from Flirt Finder and TikTok. We know TikTok is a haven for bullying. I mean there's women being crying on there. And um, they mock the disabled. These are really sick individuals that need locking up. They're not normal. It's not normal behaviour to stalk people on TikTok. It isn't. They do it to everybody. They just laugh at them. They're sad. I mean, I'm, if, if I followed their YouTube channel and their TikTok, I would, I would, my, my name would be No Brains, um, Thick Sponge, Evil Wanker, smelly old toad bitch lonely sad fuck and amongst others i mean you know these people need to be sat in a room with all the bullying comments they've made sh shouted at them for hours and see what they feel like afterwards morons so i've got to go out i've got to go out after the police have actually come into my flat lied to my face lied they can't do anything well i've just made a complaint i've made a complaint so the kent police will be getting an email with my complaint shortly And then we're going to wait for the police's complaint. And so normally I ignore it and throw it in the bin. But this time we'll be taking it further. The Independence Police Complaints Commission. And then I'm going to send that letter to the mem to Rishi Sunak or, or an MP. They came into my flat like a pair of dickheads. But it was like something out of a fucking comedy show so you've got the two of them stood there one's got a hairy beard because i said i didn't want uh, i i'm not keen on beards on flirt finder yesterday so you've got one police officer with a beard the other one looks like he's come out of twilight he's got teeth like dracula <laughs> it really it was a comedy show he had teeth like dracula because they keep taking the piss out of my teeth. They keep going, oh, Crystal, you've got a nice smile on TikTok. Hello, lovely, beautiful lady. You've got a nice smile. Yeah, well, if the dentist hadn't fucked up my teeth, I would have had a nice smile, wouldn't I? You don't see these people's faces. You don't know if they've got a mole on their bottom. Do you? Because they're just wicked, lying monsters. They're just horrible people. I wouldn't want to know them anyway. That's why they bring up all these um, fake profiles. Because they're afraid to show their face. They're a coward. And they would, you know, if they came to my face and said all the shit they've been saying. My God. So they do it underhand. They do it underhand. They do it behind your back. They make noises like monkey dicks. Ugh! Ugh! 
do you know what guys the, some people make me want to throw up they do I don't tell them that I want to throw up when I look at their face because I'm not rude so somebody on TikTok subscribe to my channel I want to chuck one I want to chuck one they want to chuck what what do they want to chuck they want to chuck up, they want to throw up, do they? Well, next time I go out, I bring a bucket out with me and they can chuck up in that, can't they? I want to chuck one. So after the monkey police came out, you know that, I mean, you know, monkeys are stupid, aren't they? I don't, I, I don't mean it derogatory, I mean monkeys, they're acting like monkeys, they do nothing, they stand there and scratch their armpits, that's what I'm talking about, uh, 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 uh. the monkey police, what do you want me to do, uh, 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 uh. no sort of police. told me that they can't do anything with comments, they can't check out who's doing it or anything, lied to my face. So I took Max out afterwards, right, and it's like everyone's heard what I've said to the police in my flat. It is. We've had a man in the meter box all morning with a black backpack like my mum. You know, a bag like my mother's black bag. Dressed up like Jennifer. Dressed up like my mother. With his black bag. They've all got to have a black bag, haven't they? Goes outside. And everything's okay until I go onto the field. There's a bloke like my father, Derek. You know, like I write in the diary. It's all the diary look. So there's an old man with this coat on. Bear in mind it's sunny out there and warm. So there's an old guy. He wants to chuck one, does he? Well, he doesn't know what a real woman is, does he? So there's the old guy with this jacket I've got on with an old man's cap and he's in his backpack and he's walking up the path he's walking up the path with a replica of my coat on it's funny is it haven't they got better things to do with their time seriously and dress up like me do they want to put my thong on do they they want to put a pair of nipple tassels and a thong on and strut their stuff down the path. I've just had a, a, a message off Flirt Finder calling me a porno queen. A porno queen. After the police left. After the police left and I complained about being harassed on Flirt Finder, I get a message calling me a porno queen. A, a porn star, in other words. A porn star. Well, to my knowledge, I'm not a porn star. Not to my knowledge. Porn star. So I, I'm, I'm walking past um, the builders coming back and one of them's doing this. <laughs> Because I said, to, the, the police said to me, Crystal, how do you know people are taking the piss out of you? How do you know it's you they're taking the piss out of? And this is grown adults' reactions after the police have been in my flat. Grown adults. So I want to chuck one, texted me on TikTok, and I've got a grown builder. Blowing on fags. <laughs> as I'm walking down the path. 
we had a grown woman bend over in a pair of the bright tight beige trousers with a big bottom and we've got to, we've got on the radio people talking about smacking children smacking kids What do you think is going to happen now? Some parents, not all parents, some parents now know it's acceptable to smack their children. Smack them. I've just listened to two radio stations and I'm not listening to fucking abusive shit. Smacking a child's bottom. What about slapping them on the wrist? Why have you got to smack them on the bottom? Why have you got to smack a child on the bottom? Grown adults talking like... I haven't heard anything like it. Why have you got to smack a child on the bottom? Grown adults talking on the radio about smacking kids. Smacking them. I turned it off. I don't want to hear it. I went on to another station and then somebody is obsessed with the arse, the bottom. Someone else on another radio station talking about bottoms. Bums and bottoms. I don't believe I'm living in the real world. What is this? You're actually discussing smacking children? Hitting kids? On one hand, you want to stop children smoking, yet it's okay to smack them. This country's fucked. It's seriously fucked. If you don't like me, don't like me because I'm fighting for justice. And I, 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 I open my mouth. I don't take any bullshit. And if anyone takes the mick out of me, I'm going to tell them to fuck off. Because I know they are. And they know they are. Never mind what the useless Mickey Mouse police are saying. Ridiculous. That has made me angry. The police coming out here, wasting my time. No notebooks. No, no police badges. No, no notebooks. No pen. And I'm a porno queen, apparently. A porno queen. Same as it happened in Victoria Road, the police came out, they, they, it was a Scots bloke. Stop harassing Crystal, they said. Scottish man. The police go out of the front door after speaking to the bloke and he rings my mobile phone after the police have gone out the door. Well, it's not going to return to what happened in 2008, 9, 10 and 11. I, it has made me angry, it's made me upset. I don't like children being abused and I don't like police not doing their job properly. And the more this carries on, this world is going to be a really, really dangerous place to live in. And it's going to be dangerous for our children growing up in it. With adults behaving like little babies, doing what they want, smoking drugs and doing things they shouldn't be doing. It's not safe for children. How can you discuss smacking children? What is wrong with this country? It's disgusting. There's something fucking wrong going on here. The police blatantly acting stupid. I thought we was in an episode of Twilight. What the fuck was that on my doorstep?
caught me off guard. I had my coat on ready to go out with the dog. Otherwise they would have been taped being absolutely damn useless. And why did they park outside the wrong block of flats as well? Right, it's made me cross, it's made me upset, but I'm going to get back on my feet and I'm going to put it to one side and, and do it, things positively. I've already made a complaint about the police. I should be writing to the government and getting in contact with members of parliament as to why the police aren't doing their job properly. See you later.